Hello and welcome back. This is going to be a quick tutorial on tokenization. All right, so here we've got a text. Super Data Science Mentorship Programs will help students master advanced machine learning, including artificial intelligence, by delving into deep learning algorithms and unsupervised computational linguistics. And when we feed this into a large language model, it's actually going to be broken up into tokens. So here you can see what the tokens look like. So uh, you can see that the word super data science, the name super data science is broken up into words. Yeah, it makes sense. But then the word mentorship is broken up into mentor and ship. Uh, but not all words are broken up like that. Uh, only select ones are broken. For example, even long words like intelligence are maintained. Um, delving is broken up, even though it's a shorter word. Unsupervised is broken up into three components. Linguistics is broken up. Um, then you can see the uh, special characters like brackets, full stops, and so on are broken, like our separate tokens. You can see that the space bars are, or like spaces are um, encompassed in the words. So basically this helps um, the large language model be more efficient and um, uh, be able to treat lots of different words. There's so many words in the English language. So there's too many of them to, um, to separately um, for the large language model to be able to work with each one separate, that will make it less efficient. On the other hand, there's too few letters. There's only 26 letters plus some special characters. So there's too few of them. So tokens is some balance in the middle, somewhere in between where, you know, not all words are tokenized as individual words, uh, but at the same time, uh, not uh, all words are broken up as well. And um, yeah, we can play more around, uh, play a bit around with this if we go to this a link over here, it's the official tokenizer from OpenAI. You can select your model, GPT-3 Legacy or GPT-3, uh, 4, and you can input your text over here. So I've got a text I've got prepared, so you can see this is the text that we were working with before. Here's another text. People overestimate what they can achieve in one year and underestimate what they can achieve in three years. And so here you can see that overestimate is broken up into two tokens, whereas under, underestimate, interestingly, is not broken up into two tokens. And that depends on the type of uh, tokenization uh, technique that is used. For example, there's um, byte pair encoding, there's word piece, there's character level tokenization, uh, there's word level tokenization and so on. There's lots of different techniques and depending on the one that's being used, uh, the result might be slightly different. But uh, for example, for the same GPT-4 model, that the same technique will be used every single time unless that model is updated. Um, here they've got a helpful rule of thumb that one token generally corresponds to four characters of text in common text English. Um, so... That, I think that means on average, because here you can see that it's usually a token is more than four characters, but if you take short words uh, then and you take a big text, then on average, it'll be about four characters. And so here's uh, about 100 tokens, it's about 75 words. So that's uh, a quick intro to tokenization. We're not going to talk more about it. It's just good to know that words are broken up. For the purposes of this course, we're going to just deal with full words to in the upcoming tutorials. We're going to look at full words in all of our examples so we don't have to worry about tokenization. But just keep that at the back of your mind that there is tokenization happening in the background with large language models. And if you'd like to read more about it, uh, here's an interesting uh, blog post where you can learn a bit more about tokenization. Now make sure to check out these videos on the right or the full course in the description to continue your learning. And I look forward to seeing you there.